so 7.31 a.m. I uh, just got into the office a few minutes ago. Just sitting down now going through the pregame show. Um, this is the rundown that uh, we've been working on since Wednesday. Uh, I spent a lot of time on it yesterday, probably a good six or seven hours. So now I'm just kind of going through and making sure all my notes are set and that I'm kind of ready to go. And I'll head over, sit down with Jerry and Howard, talk through things with them. <laughs> Dave Rose and Jerry Donato, Howard Griffith. It is a, a huge day. Here at the network, this will be the first of many reminders. BTN.com slash GameFinder, so you know the channel for the game in your area. Man, I thought we had a really good pregame. I thought uh, everyone was energized. It's exciting to, you know, think that we're only a week away from conference play and getting fired up for tailgate next week. The fact that Howard's coming along with us is going to be really cool. So, you know, I have such great chemistry with Jerry and Howard. Enjoy those guys so much that that's two hours of my week that I always look forward to and I'm just so energized by. So it's weird because on a normal Saturday, you can't really process it. It, it always, it's two hours, you think about it all week, and then you go in the green room and you start watching the games and you're on to the next thing. So now I guess the next thing's the game. I'm, I'm excited to get going and, and just to do something different. I mean, I love my job. I, I hope that comes across. It's awesome. But it is fun to do something different every once in a while and to have a, a different challenge. And so I think I've really been looking forward to this. It's, uh, you know, something that I've known about since the summer that, hey, we'd love to try to do this on, on this particular day, given that we have nine games and the games in Chicago. Would you be up for it? Absolutely. And so, you know, just fired up to finally be here and, and get the chance to do it. Hi, everyone, and welcome to Soldier Field. Great to have you with us. Dave Rebson alongside Jay Lehman, the former Fighting Illini All-American. You know, I think all of us, um, I, I don't want to speak for everyone, but I think most guys who are sportscasters, you know, you love being out and you love calling a game. I, it's something I really enjoy with basketball, too. I'm so fortunate to be able to do both. I kind of know my bread is buttered in the studio, but the notion of being able to go and the flexibility of BTN, certainly to call a bunch of basketball games and to do this, uh, it's fun, you know? It's just something different that, that keeps you invigorated. Barnett rolling to his left, throws into the end zone, Solomon, and it is a touchdown. Rivers going to throw it towards the end zone. He's got Smalling, but he overthrows him, and that is the game. We had a great crew, and Mike Rodolfi, the spotter, unbelievable. He's so good. Uh, Nick Punto did a great job on stats. I just felt like we were really in sync. I love working with Jay. Uh, he is incredibly good. I remember doing his audition years ago and, and thinking that he was going to be special, a really good broadcaster, and, and he has turned out to be. So great uh, crew in the truck. And, and just, you know, I felt like technically we had a really good show. You know, I jotted down notes after the game last year of kind of, how does this work? It was the first time I'd ever done a TV game for football. This year was the second. I think I'll do the same thing maybe tomorrow, kind of sit down and, okay, you know, what, what did I do well? What didn't I do well? Maybe even watch the tape, which is something I don't do very much anymore, but um, I think it would be valuable. But just had a blast, beautiful day, and, and a ton of fun. Four minutes to seven, back to the office. Let's go. What are you guys doing? We still have to do the final drive. Not, not me. Oh, man. That's like a half day. So Blau is at 588 right now. So right now he's three yards over for the total offense. Three yards over for the total offense. But that can go back to like second right. level. Right. I'd say regardless of all the way or not all the way, it was a really good day. Dwayne Haskins had a good day too. 344 yards, a couple touchdown passes. He ran for a touchdown as well. That does it for us on the final. There's a surprise. Well, we're walking out. It's 1221. I think we walked in right around 730. So just shy of 17 hours, which is actually about two hours shorter than last week when we had the West Coast Arizona State game. But of course that was all spent here today. A little bit of a change up going out to call the game, but I would say it was an honest day's work. 